Beating Allentown was going to be a tall order for Pemberton on the best day of the season, and it was quickly evident during Saturday's West Jersey Football League game that this wasn't the best day of the season. You know, I told them they're a good football team, and, you know, a good football team, you can't give them anything, and we gave them, I don't know how many penalties we had, easy penalties like offsides and face masks. So, you know, we would have had to play a perfect game to beat them, and obviously we didn't. Sadiq Queen's red zone interception killed a promising early drive by the Hornets and set up the first Allentown touchdown on an 81-yard pass to Queen from freshman quarterback Dan Merkel. Queen intercepted the next Pemberton pass as well, and Xavier Harris made the Hornets pay for that miscue. She threw the ball and it was kind of a little short, so I jumped up for it and I fell uh, like two yards short from the end zone. So then we ran our, when our uh, muscle plays and then I just well, I walked in the end zone basically. Harris added his first touchdown catch on Allentown's next possession and the Redbirds got basic after that. Rasan Emery, who totaled 25 carries for 111 yards, scored on runs of four and two to give Allentown a 34-0 lead. Pemberton's only touchdown came on a 53-yard pass from Octavius Sharkey to Tysheen Williams late in the first half, but Allentown tacked on two more in the second, including an 86-yard pass from Merkel to Harris. Merkel, he threw, a, he threw a good ball and I adjust to it, and then I turned around and there was nobody behind me, so I was like, gotta get to the end zone. I thought I thought somebody was gonna like hit me, but then when I looked back, it was like, like somebody was, number two was like 10 yards off of me. I'm like, all right, and then I just ran. Allentown's 48-8 win dropped the Hornets below the 500 mark at two and three. You know, I told them we, we have Cherry Hill East next and you know, they're struggling and if, if, we don't, if we don't shake this off and prepare right, then we're gonna, you know, have a hard time next week too. So we'll see what happens. We'll see who jumps ship and who's ready to play next week. From William McDowell Field in Pemberton, this is John Lewis.